Hi guys, in this video we are going to learn how to write flowchart to find sum of first 100 natural numbers. Here we have to find sum of first 100 natural numbers. Natural number is a positive integer start with 1, 2, 3 up to infinity. Here we have to find sum of first 100 natural numbers that is 1 plus 2 plus 3 up to plus 100. Here we have to find sum of first 100 natural numbers. Flowchart. Flowchart is a graphical representation of solved problem. Flowchart is start with start statement. So first we have to draw start statement. Start statement is writing within a oval shape. Next. Here no need to read input values because here they give and write. Here we have to find sum of first natu 100 natural numbers. Initial values 1 and we have to add till number 100. So, no need, no need to read input values. Here, we have to initialize values, declare values, i and some values. Declaration is done within a rectangular shape. So, here we have to draw rectangular shape. Within that, we have to declare values, initial value. Initial value, i is equal to 1. i is equal to 1. Declare i is equal to 1. Next, initially, sum is equal to 0, right? So, here we have to declare i and sum value. Initially, i is equal to 1 and sum is equal to 0. Next, we have to start process. That is writing within a rectangular shape. Within that, we have to write sum is equal to sum plus i. Sum is equal to sum plus i. Next, we have to increase the value of i. Initially it is 1 and next it is increased by 1. i plus 1. See here. Here initially sum is equal to. What is the value of initially sum is equal to 0 right. So 0 plus 1. i value is 1 right. It become 1. Sum initially sum is equal to 1. Next i value is Initially, i value is equal to 1. It becomes 1 plus 1. That is equal to 2. Next, we have to check. If i value is less than or equal to 100. If i value is, here i value is less than or equal to 100. If this condition is true, we have to repeat this process again if this condition is true true here i value is 2 right 2 is less than or equal to 100 if this condition is true right so here it goes to here some value it calculates some value again sum is equal to our some last value is 1 right 1 plus i value is 2 it become 1 plus 2 2 is 3. Next, it will calculate i is equal to 2 plus uh, i plus 1, right? That is 2 plus 1. It becomes 3. Again, it will check if i value is less than or equal to 100. i value is 3. 3 is less than or equal to 100. It is true, right? Again, it will goes to calculate some value. It will repeat until i value is less than or equal to 100. If it is greater than 100, it become false, right? In case i value is equal to 100 plus 101, if 101 less than or equal to 100, it is false, right? That time it will come out of this loop. If this condition is false, we have to print the output value. What is the output value? Here we have to print the sum of first 100 natural numbers, right? So here we have to print some value here we have to print some value output values is writing within a parallelogram shape next we have to stop the algorithm sorry we have to stop the flowchart using stop statement stop statement is writing within a oval shape so guys this is the flowchart to find sum of first hundred natural numbers 
it is start with the start statement it is writing within oval shape next we have to declare i is equal to 1 that is initial value i is equal to 1 initially sum is equal to 0 right so we have to declare sum is equal to 0 declaration is done within a rectangular shape next we have to write operation or process calculation process that is sum is equal to sum plus i calculation is done within a rectangular shape in flowchart calculation is always done within a rectangular shape so we have to write some calculation in rectangular shape that is sum is equal to sum plus i next we have to increase the i value by 1 that is i is equal to i plus 1 next we have to check i is it i value is less than or equal to 0 if this condition is true we have to again go back to some calculation and repeat repeat all these process until i value is less than or equal to 100 next if this condition is false we have to come out of this loop and we have to print this output value and here condition is if condition is value is always writing within a diamond shape next we have to print output value print print some value next we have to stop the flowchart using stop statement so guys this is the flowchart to find sum of first 100 natural numbers all the best if you like my video please like and subscribe my channel thank you for watching